thank you for all the birthday wishes. Now, normally I like to spend my birthday alone and I'll tell y'all why in a second, but my friend wanted to go bar hopping. I wanted to go bar hopping. So I said, shenanigans. But shenanigans weren't had. Ugh. The group started dwindling down until it was just my friend and I. We were both in party mode. We wanted to drink and turn up, listen to music, dance, but there was nothing going on in the area that we were in. So I suggested we just get an Uber and go to a different part of town. She was hesitant because she didn't want to leave the area, but eventually she agreed because it was my birthday. <laughs> and right after we finished our, is it lychee or lychee? It sounds like you said the same thing, but mm. right after we ate that, <laughs> she changed her mind. She said that she had too much to drink and she should go home. And I parked at her place. So as we were leaving out to walk back, I saw a bench and I was like, you know, I'm just gonna sit here and figure out where I wanna go next. And she was like, how about we just walk to this bar down there and we just go get some drinks. You just said you had too much to drink. So just go home. She just didn't want to go where I wanted to go. And that is how I ended up alone on my birthday. Now I know that that was the original plan, but things changed and it wasn't by choice, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. And it's no fault of hers. We didn't plan to hang out together. It doesn't matter. I knew that I had a choice. Turn this frown upside down and I kept walking around to find me what was going to make me happy. And y'all know me. I'm a foodie and food will do the trick every single time. <laughs> but back to what I was saying earlier, I normally spend my birthday alone. My birthday is the one day in the year where I could do whatever I wanna do and not think about what everyone else wants to do or where they wanna go or what they've planned for you, which is really what they want you to do. And even though I didn't get to turn up and go out to a club, I still got to dance. <laughs> All that dancing motivated me to get up and work out and I fucking hate working out. So this morning I hit the stairs in this building and I've got, I don't know, like 30 flights. I'm already tired. The fuck? Time to put the music on and get to it. Dancing while working out is the only way I can get through it. came back in here to work on my abs because, and I ate rice today, so my stomach hurts. And somebody asked me, was this a food baby? I know, yes. <laughs> yes it is, fuck it. All right. <laughs> a little aggressive, but uh, y'all, Y'all get what I'm trying to say. I'm working on it, all right? Okay. <laughs> I'm about to be on the road soon. I can't be out here in these streets with a mom bod. I need to get it together. <laughs> Thank you guys. The countdown has begun. I will be back in my car really soon. 